Welcome to this episode of Moon Bats. I'm already bleeding and things are going great. They're really, I swear. Okay, so I've done so many things and I have to bring you up to speed. Uh, I really wanted to film this with my other camera and like a proper microphone, but I'm here and I'm in the middle of stuff. And you know what? You're just gonna have to watch this with this camera because uh, yeah, it's too much stuff and I wanna get you caught up so I can keep going. So let's see where I'm at. I did a lot of electrical work. Last time the bars were just put on and that was it but I did all the electrical work. So I'm gonna show you what I did. So here it is. These are my little turn signals. I wanna look at, show you these guys. I made them on my lathe with like uh, two pieces of tubing things, you know, wires, they turn on, and then these are running lights and also flashers. Um, I don't wanna turn the key on, the battery, all that stuff. But these are my little turn signals. You can see them here. There's two of them. I'm legal-ish. Legalish, that's kind of the name of this bike maybe. No, I don't name my bikes. Um, but, so the bars have these buttons, which are the turn signal buttons, and those are internally wired and they come down here. All this stuff goes tucked under the tank here. Um, all this extra wire, all the other wiring's in here. So, up here, okay, let me show you what I got going on up here. So, this is the new tank. I said I didn't know if this had this. It does, these little indicator things. So these are wired in. This guy right here is my high beam, low beam, no beam, high beam, low beam, no beam, high beam, low beam, no beam, high beam. This is my headlights for up there, the little headlight up there, right there. And this little button right here, we'll bring you over here, is my horn. Bang, 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 imagine. Um, so that is, the vast majority of the stuff that was on the board, on the handlebars. Turn signals, headlights, horn. Now, okay, now comes the fun part. Um, you're gonna have to imagine, imagine for a second that I have a seat. This is a secret, you're not looking at this right now. Don't look at this, shh. Okay, so imagine for a second I have a seat here. This guy right here is my kill switch. Run, no run. Run, no run, run, or something like that. Basically, when I, I can reach down and just go bleh, bleh. I think I have it so that up is off and then, I don't know, it doesn't matter. One of these is the kill switch. That's the kill switch. And then when you come over here, check this guy out. Just a starter button, just a starter button. You know, used to be up here. Used to be up here. No, now it's down here. So that is my starter button. So I made all this, did all the wiring. They all work. Everything works. Everything works. Tested it. I didn't run the bike because there's no gas in the gas tank, but like everything works. Yeah, all that stuff. It's good. Um, so, okay. So now this is, oh, this is stressful. Um, I'm doing a lot of things. I made a paper template of a crazy Frank seat that I wanted to make for this bike. Um, and then I put on some sheet metal and I just took an angle grinder and I cut it out and bent it all up. And this is blurry, is what I've got. Let's see, yeah, this is what I've got. So this isn't welded on, it's literally held on by those little pieces of tape right now. But this is like what it's starting to look like. I'm gonna cut it, you can kinda see here there's a little line right here. This is where I'm gonna cut the fender so it's gonna come up like to match this uh, sha sha part. And then I'm gonna do something that is gonna make a lot of people really mad. I am going to cut my struts off right here, okay? Then I'm gonna internally, inside, inside of these bad boys, I'm gonna put um, a strut that's gonna go all the way from here, all the way back, and then it's gonna go on the inside here and then all the way to the other side. The idea being that I will still have access to these two mounting points right here and right here so I can mount saddlebags in the future 
without having any strut here. So I'll have to put a little, little spacer there, but it'll be internal struts. And I've already reinforced the frame in here. You can see that the paint is all fucked uh, with some metal, metal here. And then I am going to, I can't find it, but, oh, wait, maybe this is it? No, maybe that's it, no. Anyways, I'm gonna put some tabs to come here that are, you know, just like that here. They're gonna come up here and they're gonna bolt right here and here, so two tabs that are gonna bolt into this internal strut. So it's gonna have one, two, three, four uh, mounting points. And so that's gonna be stronger than anything else that I've got. Uh, it's gonna be plenty strong. Like I'm using some beefy ass metal, some good tabs, well, I reinforced it all. Everything should be pretty freaking good there. Um, so like, this is very much in the like, ooh, maybe this is gonna work, maybe this isn't gonna work. But I'll have to like, fill these holes in. I'm still gonna use this to mount my seat. Right here, I'm gonna put a sissy bar coming out or inside or I'll figure the sissy bar out. So it comes out just like a regular Crazy Frank. And then it'll probably be internal. And then I'll put two bolts on the inside or some tubing or, you know, just, or maybe I'll come all the way through to the struts down here. I don't really know what I'm doing. That's, that's later. For right now, we're just, we're working on this. So I got to like clean it up a little bit and, you know, make it nice and like all this stuff. But this, this is going to be good. This is going to be. So I know what you're thinking. You're asking yourself. But Tony, where are you gonna run a brake light? Where are you gonna run turn signals? Well, let me show you. I've got this guy right here. It's gonna go right here. Oh wait, this guy right here. It's gonna go right there. So that's gonna be in there. That's gonna be my brake light. I'll angle this up right so it makes sense. And then my, my uh, license plate will fit right in here somewhere. Um, here's the, the brake light. I don't know if you can see that, but it'll be fine. Everything will be good. Um, so that's kind of uh, where I'm at. Now that I'm looking at it, I might need to angle it a bit more. Like, like, oh, it, it shifted, that's why. My tape, that's, it's just moving a little bit. There's no like real, real stuff going on here. This is, this is what happens when you, it's just, everything's good. So that's, that's where I'm at right now. Um, maybe what I'll do is, I'll try to do another video of me like finishing this stuff off, but I wanted to bring you up to speed because I'm, I'm, I'm trying to like stay consistent here. So this is where I'm at. I'm at like, this is middle of a project. Like literally like, if you ever fabricated stuff, you, you know you're always hesitant to show people like, oh, this is where I'm at because nobody ever really gets it. They get it, you think they get it and then they're just like, oh no, like, Oh, I don't see it. So if you don't see it, just have some patience. You'll see it eventually. Um, in the meantime, I think that this will just be a short video because the last ones are like 30 minutes, right? Um, I got some good ones coming up too uh, for some history stuff. So maybe those will be in between. Maybe they already happened. I don't know. I recorded it the other day with Dan. So that was really fun. Um, like, subscribe. And like, if you hate this, I mean, tell me, but it doesn't matter because... It's too late. By the time you see this, it's already going to be done. And it's going to be bad. It's going to be badass. I'm, I'm into it. I'll, yeah. Like, subscribe. See you next time.